This video is brought to you by Envato Elements. Let's get a drink. Here we go. Hey guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to create this magic trick where I grab a drink from screen inside of Adobe After Effects. Let's get right into it. First let's see what shots we need to shoot. In the main shot I put a green background on the screen and play the whole scene. I let the banknote fall and then pretended to push a button on the screen. Finally, I reached behind the monitor and grabbed a glass of juice, which was sitting on this box. Then I kept the camera in the exact same position and recorded a clean plate. Next I set up a green screen, poured the juice into the glass and grabbed it. We'll use this shot in the computer screen. Now we also need to have the animation which is going to be visible on the screen. I recorded my screen where I search in the browser and prepared this machine in Photoshop. Creating things like this can be very time consuming. So you could use some help from today's sponsor Envato Elements. On Envato Elements you'll find thousands of assets for any kind of project you're working on. Like these graphic elements, templates and much more. It's an amazing tool for all creators offering a huge library with tons of creative assets and presets. They offer great stock footage, including green screen clips like fog, fire, lightning, water and literally anything you'll need. This library also includes professional Premiere Pro and After Effects templates, VFX packs, intros, transitions, text animations, as well as sound effects and music. It allows you to download unlimited amount of all these assets just for a single price and you can cancel it anytime. It will definitely save you a lot of time in the post-production. Make sure to check it out, there is a link in the description down below. Once we have all these things prepared, we can start editing. So let's open up After Effects. First place all shots on the timeline. The main shot on the bottom, above that the clean plate and the green screen shot on top of everything. Now let's remove the green screen from our main shot. Search for key light effect and apply it to the layer. Pick the green color, adjust the settings and add advanced spill suppressor effect which will remove the green spill. Next bring in the video which we are going to place on the screen and synchronize it with the main shot. Move this layer below the main shot, adjust the scale and use CC power pin effect to make it fit into the screen. Since my monitor is curved, I also used mesh warp effect to adjust it. Now we need to animate the button when I touch it. So I went back into the computer screen composition. Since these are all Photoshop layers, I can just animate the button as a separate layer. I keyframed the scale and animated it according to the main shot. Next I took the green screenshot of the juice being poured in the glass and placed it into the computer screen composition. Then I remove the green screen and position it so that it lines up with our main shot. To make this transition even better, I used the mesh warp effect and adjusted the hand on the edge of the screen. Furthermore, we need to hide the banknote which is falling on the table. Select the clean plate shot and draw a mask around the area which you wanna hide. And feather out the mask. Then I selected the main shot and made another mask precisely around the hand. 
I animated it and set the mask blending mode to subtract. Now we have this. Additionally, we need to hide this box in the background. I duplicated the clean plate layer and made a mask around it. Sometimes the hand goes in front of this mask, so we need to fix that. I duplicated the main shot and put it on top of the timeline. Then I used the Roto Brush tool to create a mask around the hand. And I did the same for the other part. At this point we can pre-compose all these layers. Finally top it all off with some fake camera movement and color grading. And we are done. If you found this helpful please consider subscribing. And I'll see you in the next video.